Hello everybody, welcome back to Journey with Arrows. Thank you for joining me again today. Um, we are back at one of my favourite places, and which is the Fight Club Hatches, and we're joined by some friends of mine. So we're going to go head out, we'll have a look at their kit, we'll get rigged up, and let's go shoot in. So guys, the bow that I'm using today is Freddie Archery's um, KTB, Korean traditional bow. Um, it's by Freddie Archery. It's a beautiful bow. Um, this is one that's been donated by Jed, you've seen shooting with us today. Um, so we'll put close-ups in the video anyway so you can have a nosy. This is 50 pounds at 32 inches. It is a speed demon. It is absolutely solid and it shoots like a rocket. Um, so yeah, you're going to see anyway. You'll see it shooting. Um, Let's look at the look at the other guys' bows. We've got some really nice bows with us today. Um, so yeah, it's going to be a good shoot. 21. I can believe that one that you, Chris, that you're using, Chris, is probably one of his best models because it's that that kind of shape's very hard to get that. Right. consideration to the loops as well, you know what I mean? So guys, just before we start the video for today, um, there are four of us, as you've noticed, and there are 40 targets on this course, um, very difficult targets, some far away, some up close, and Depending as to how well or how poorly we shoot, we're going to be looking at shooting a maximum of three arrows per target. Um, obviously with four of us, that works out at 480 shots um, in total. Which we're not going to film all of and we're certainly not going to put all in the video. So the video today is just going to be a collection of actually shots from different targets, different points in the course. Um, you're not going to see us all shoot the same target because that's just going to be ridiculous and we don't have the time for that. So anyway, I'll stop rambling. I hope you guys enjoy the video, enjoy the clips and enjoy the scenery that this fantastic archer course has to offer. And uh, yeah, enjoy it chaps. Thank you. I've got every faith in you hitting me. Nicely done. Hey, that sounded good. All like stiff out. Those are, it's only a 30, it's only 41 at 31. Mm. Uh, he doesn't draw to 31 most of the time. A bit like the bow. Quite an aim. And then pray. And then pray. I see some Korean power, Dave. Oh, a bit short. Sunday, that that looks pretty close. Okay. <laughs> Almost feel like you're shooting through the bluebells at that, don't you? Yeah. Oh, 
money. There we go. That's all good. Lovely, very nice. It's a cracking target, isn't it? Yeah. Straight in the 24, you watch. Oh, Beautiful. Again. You must do a hell of a lot of editing. Yeah, he's the edit master. Did you hear that? <laughs> <laughs> Going hungry. <laughs> Just over. Flower. Just over. 24. It's a nice shot. <laughs> That's, That's a nice shot. <laughs> Thank you. Wow. Beautiful. I've knocked over targets once. That was your first, wasn't it, Dave? It was. Oh, you've got to have a shot, then, not you? Straight in. Go on, I get going. Yeah, I was trying to get a good cleft shot there, to be fair. <laughs> Boom! Yeah. Wonderful. Thank you. And then we'll just zoom in there. Get a side as well, so you can see the... <laughs> Yep. Oh. What, Mr. Boss? Shot, yeah. Go on, get your shotgun going. Poof. That's a good hit. Two out of two. Lovely. Right, got you. Yep. 
Here we see Jed in his natural habitat. I'm not entirely sure if he's lo looking for his dignity or for an arrow. <laughs> if you fall in, do we get 250 quid? <laughs> You've been framed. Possibly come in from above on the left. Right. Oh, that thing's... <laughs> <laughs> nothing, <laughs> nothing like getting your boots wet, is there? Right. <laughs> Please, Tug. No, it's the only reason why I got the camera out. It's still time. <laughs> Lovely yeah. bit of wood between the legs there, <laughs> Jason. <laughs> so, I mean, <laughs> Freddie Archery's Korean bow, my god, it's quick. I don't think it's 50 pounds. I don't have my bow scales with me, but we're going to get it on the bow scales when we're back. Um, even Jed was saying himself that he doesn't think this is 50 pounds. He thinks it's heavier. I think it's heavier. Um, yeah, I mean, trying to get this to full draw, it, it stacks a lot, surprisingly, for, for the bow. Um, we'll get it on the scales when we get back, but bloody hell. I think I might compete with this bow next. I think we're going to be, uh, well, I'm, I'm pleasantly surprised. And so far today, it's going quite good. So we shall uh, see how it goes. So it goes. Even if I'm in light when you look at the field, it's exerting something incredible that poor thing of first day. Yep, nice. Love a bit of elk. Tastes good. Did you put your arrow in the bow the right way, yeah? I think I did. <laughs> Looking at that, I'm not so sure. <laughs> Judd's crotch. It's a long shot, a long shot down. That's I think it's actually a very good course. Yeah. Yeah. Just left the candle from here. Right. No, it's not. I'm just thinking where it would be a fight. It would be from there. Just as there. Wind in there. Yeah. Right next to yeah, we'll drop, we'll drop. Langdale Pikes in the distance. All I see is a lot of wooden steps to the start. See the white spot? Go for the white spot. It's not even a bear. It's just a white spot floating. It's barely even there. Ba -bum. <laughs> just bare left a bit. That's unbearable. It is unbearable. God. It was a bit grisly, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I think I'm the polar opposite. It's in for that panda spot. Those steps are safe so far. Oh, 
Oh! That's right, there's light in the spot. Very nice. Very nice. They still sold it for you, is that not discriminatory? <laughs> we got a right one here, let's send, let's send in this one. <laughs> Barely made it, Dave. Barely made it. Barely made it. What do his legs? Can't see anything from here. Can barely Walk see a thing. Sharp. Thank you. Do you walk and if a lamb <laughs> came in here, just behind it, yeah. what colour would it be? I need to stop wearing these long blouses, don't I? <laughs> Yay! <laughs> One out of twelve. Look at this. I just shoot between the two bits of tree there. <laughs> he really did not want to stop focusing on it, he yeah. just go dick dick dick. Yeah, it's alright. So that one's alright. I think with any boat, because it's so strong, you can see on slow motion the arrows come out and they wibble. Oh, that's unreal, it really. takes a long time for it to straighten out. Yeah. There's a real problem with shorter targets. Nice. That's all right. Beautiful. of everybody's shooting uh, from myself and Jed and Ed and Chris. Um, it's been a, a good day. The, the weather was forecast to rain so we've been really lucky in not having the rain today. Uh, it's been brilliant, it's been cracking. And, uh, I'm knackered now, I'm actually aching. I've got work again tomorrow so I need a good rest. Um, the other guys have just gone so I'm going to have a quick few extra shots with the, with the Freddy Archery's Korean bow. And uh, I think we're probably going to kind of call it there, to be honest with you guys. Um, the next video may well be a review on the KTV. So Jed's left this with me for the time being to do a review on. So we'll, we'll do that for you on the next video. I need to start being able to get this to full draw because this is a monster. A deceptive looking monster for, for the, the, the draw weight that it is. Or that it isn't in this case. So we need to get it on the scales when we get home. Um, but yeah, so for myself, thank you very much for tuning into Journey with Arrows again. Um, 
you'll see me on the next video. And until then, guys, take care and uh, stay tuned. Bloody monster. <laughs> Smell the burn!